gold started the week on a slight bullish note it has already achieved 2023 levels now what to expect from gold how to profit today we will see with the help of charts and indicators first update for the day next update will be released before the us session do watch that as well do like share subscribe and comment it is always a great motivation for me to deliver twice a day updates watch till the end towards the end i will be give you the trading levels and strategy and yes if you have not joined the channel memberships do join the channel memberships and enjoy the benefits also uh, no major news coming in today which can impact the volatility or which can bring the volatility in gold uh, yes the us markets are closed today and thus later in the day we might see diminished volatility so let's start first we look into early charts on the early charts you can look at it is cross this channel it is trying to trade bullish reverse here rise retracement rise retracement so what it is trying to do it is trying to create a bullish channel where are the support support here at around 14 20 15 levels this is going to be a major support and with that as support it can continue to stay bullish there is a very strong probability to it thus 2014 2015 levels you should watch out for the day stock isk is overbought on the early charts macd is divergent and bullish rsi is near to overbought levels it has come out of the overbought zone coming to 2 hr look at 2 hr charts movement see it was consolidating here then rise and reversal the drop and the reversal then bullishness consolidation first bullish candle again consolidating here and it can continue with the bullishness here see preceding candle was a indecision candle also this was outside bulling up bands and that is why we can see it closing somewhere in close to the bulling up bands this candle can again stay bullish and possibility for it to move towards 2024 uh, levels is there so it appears for the day 2014 2024 is the zone where we should not take any trade the stock is taking is overbought here macd is divergent and bullish and it has seen a very good rise very good recovery here the so possibility of a reversal exists rsi is overbought coming to 3 hr chart now look at 3 hr charts in my friday's update in my last trading session update i have mentioned very clearly see what it is doing consolidation nice cup and handle is formed and that is what beautifully it has achieved also uh the second observation here is the lower highs which is, it has achieved here on the 3 hr charts and it is still staying in this bearish channel and that is why i said that as long as 20 30 35 zone is not taken we should not be treating gold as bullish and specifically beyond 20 40 42 is where we can expect that it is trying to reverse now look at the moving averages it is starting to convert but it is still not yet crossed over also look at the movement here and it is just staying in this bullish course at the same time it is also changing gears a bit see uh look at this candle and this candle the bullishness is getting diminished but at this it has to break below 2014 and 2010 levels in order to confirm complete reversal the stock is like overbought macd is divergent macd is bullish looking upwards rsi uh, has seen a high and now is starting to look down that's not a good sign for the bulls here coming to 4 hr charts look at 4 hr charts what it is done the sharp drop retracement lower highs here it has to break below this highs that is from where the candle has started if it breaks this highs then you can consider that it is reversing and possibly more rise can be expected else it should not be uh, considered as bullish it should not be considered for a complete reversal also look at the 4 hr charts the body size is increasing and it is still got the bullishness here stock is taking overbought macd is divergent bullish rsi is rising coming to the daily look at the daily charts moving average is crossing over here this is signs of bearishness also one must notice after the sharp drop we have seen it recovering here and yes it has achieved the 20 and 50 period moving average also this is a greater resistance zone as long as 20 25 levels the median of the bullinger bands are not breached thus for the day between 2014 and 2024 25 we have to be cautious this could be considered as a no trade zone before we look into further details if you want to learn this art of trading be a part of my 29th mentorship batch commencing on 4th of march register yourself now equip yourself with the right tools and strategies which can help you trade profitably also you can be part of my signals channel on telegram where trading as per the signals you can benefit again ping me on telegram or write an email for any of your queries related to the services remember learning is the only investment which can be profits for you throughout your life thus register for the batch and do visit my platform forexonline.com and do join the free telegram channel for live market updates on the platform forexonline you get all the market related updates and also you can book a call with me if you need any consultation or guidance see stock is taking on the daily charts is rising macd 
is trying to converge crossover let me show you something on the macd see this was the rise it has retraced and a crossover here can lead to bullish momentum rsi is rising as well considering this i will recommend you to buy here at 2024 25 levels expect it to move towards 28 rather i will say uh, see 30 32 is the zone which you should watch out for which is going to be a greater resistance but before that itself it is going to uh, you know if it is bearish it should not break past by 20 30 32 zone and it could reverse or stay within the zone beyond 20 32 we can look forward to 20 36 and then 20 40 42 levels 40 42 is the next milestone which should be considered as a critical resistance zone Be beyond this sky is the limit gold is going to fly we can again look forward to 2060 2060 fine zone on the downside a selling entry 2014 can be taken but it has to break below 2008 2010 which is going to be the first important support levels and below that you can expect it to move towards 2090 97 levels take your trades accordingly like share subscribe and comment do watch the next update before the us session as well thank you have a great profitable trading day ahead thank you